Hold the microphone firmly and remove the three head grill screws. Use your thumb as a guide so that you don't slip and scratch the microphone. Remove the head assembly and set it aside. Flip the microphone over and remove the one screw at the base of the body tube. With the microphone right side up, press down on the top plate while pushing up on the body tube. Be careful not to let the amplifier slip out of the body tube. Remove the phone damper. Turn over the microphone and insert a flathead screwdriver into one of the two notches between the tube and the socket. Use this notch to gently start prying out the tube. After the tube has started to separate from the socket, work your way around the tube evenly. Locate the three contacts on the tube socket. Angle the tube socket outward by holding these contacts with one hand. Hold down on the tube with the other hand. Flip the microphone upside down and locate the three consecutive tube socket holes. Now locate the three consecutive pins on the tube. Hold down on the tube socket with one hand while inserting the new tube into the socket at an angle. With the pins aligned to the socket holes, use your thumb to push the tube into the socket while pressing down on the socket with your other fingers. Slide the foam damper under the tube and then pull it up into place. Slide the body tube over the amplifier, lining up the bottom screw hole with the bottom bell. Put the head assembly back on, lining up the contacts on the top plate. Insert and tighten the three head grill screws. Flip the microphone over. Insert and tighten the one screw at the base of the body tube. The narration was recorded using the exact microphone you saw in the video, a Telefunken U47.